Well, recently, the longest serving Dothan City Commissioner passed away at the age of 98. Today, WDHN's Robert Smith caught up with family friends about the impact that John Glanton leaves behind on this city. Longtime friends were saddened to hear the news Sunday morning that their dear friend John Glanton Jr. passed away after battling an illness. I wish we had had more conversations. I wish we had um, written more things down. And uh, especially with a person of, of Mr. Glanton's status. A history maker he was. Glanton was elected as the first black Dothan commissioner in 1973, where he served for 30 years. Also the longest tenured city commissioner in the Dothan history books. Garrett has known Glenn for over 50 years, teaching together at Carver High School, growing up in the same church, and even spent some time working on his campaign. Mr. Glanton also established what he called a citizen's advisory committee from his district. People he would bring together, talk about concerns uh, from our district, and maybe look at ways that uh, we might be able to to resolve some of those concerns. Glanton was also a part of various community organizations on the board of Hulk Houston Youth Enrichment Center, the Men's Civic Club, and the Dothan Housing Authority. Being a businessman, he had the ability to not only be a successful businessman, but to also not forget about the, the ability to be charitable and um, genuine. So for those folks who couldn't maybe make their rent, he could make that happen for him. He says most importantly, Glenn taught his generation and future generations how to be a true public servant, and that's what they'll miss the most. The history of John Glenn is told. It'll be told with passion. It'll be told authentically, and it'll be one of those stories that's worth telling over and over again. Reporting in Dothan, Robert Smith, WDHN News for the Wiregrass. A celebration of life for Mr. Glanton will be held at the First Missionary Baptist Church Saturday morning at 11 o'clock.